Hi there, welcome, welcome back. My name is Jen and I'm so happy to have you here with me today because we're going over July's Glam Bag and Box Charm Box by Ipsy. So let's get started. So we're planning the great escape this month, which means good vibes are landing and a great self-care routine is like a vacay. So prioritize what makes you feel amazing this summer and nothing makes me feel more amazing than creating fun looks with Ipsy. So let's get started. First product we're gonna try out in this box is the Sweet Dreams Collagen Glow gold eye masks and this is already so soothing look at all that gold oh that feels so good and what we're gonna do is we're gonna rub that right in and i can already tell you that my eyes are loving this this feels so refreshing it's a hot day out here so this right here feels like heaven we're gonna leave the eye mask on for 10 to 15 minutes and it is infused with ingredients such as camilla oil 2% niacinamide, 10 hyaluronic acids, 17 amino acids, 5 peptides, hydrolyzed collagen, aloe extract, and pumpkin extract. And the eye masks help hydrate, nourish, brighten, soothe, and depuff dull, tired looking skin. And Lord knows it has been a week. So this right here is so refreshing to have on. While we're at it, we might as well go in with some lip butter. And this is from Head Candy. And this is Go Better Lemon Citrus. Whoa, that definitely smells very citrusy. Oh, this smells good, but it feels better because ah, my lips are happy. My lips are honestly some of the driest lips ever. And so this right here just revived some life into my lips and oh, it feels so, so good. So it's been 15 minutes and I'm going to take off the mask. Whew, that feels so good. And as expected, my eyes feel just, oh, so refreshed. What we're gonna do is we're gonna rub it around the eyes and just get the formula going and let it dry up. Ooh, it feels so, so good. Now we're gonna add the Malin and Goats Vitamin E Face Moisturizer. And this lightweight moisturizer synthesizes natural vitamin E, chamomile, and absorbs fatty acids, gently and effectively hydrates, balances, and calms all skin types. You had me at moisturizer, but honestly, my heart is just loving the sound of a hydrated and balanced and calm skin because sometimes I have, especially when it's dry right now, my skin gets really, really dry. And as I mentioned before, my skin's a little bit of a skin whore. So let's see how it takes to this. And we're just gonna add a little bit to the fingertips. And already it feels good. So now let's rub it in. Oh, that feels so, so, so good. My skin, I remember I told you it was a little bit of a whore. It is loving this. It is loving this moisturizer, mainly because it is lightweight, so it doesn't really feel like you have much product on. I don't know if you can tell, but can you see a little bit of a glow? My skin is glowing, but not overly glowy, but just it feels and looks really happy. Oh, it's a moisturizer. The moisturizer has a little bit of a fragrance. I can't really pinpoint what exactly it smells like, but it smells refreshing and it smells kind of like nature, but it's a very subtle scent. You might want to keep that in mind if you have an allergy to fragrance. We're now going to use Le Brow, an eyebrow gel from Trust Fund Beauty to tame the hairs we have going on in our brows. <gasps> and I'm loving this applicator. I don't know if you can see it. Ooh, and I'm loving this wand applicator because it really allows us to get right in there and really just tame these brows. I'm blessed in that I don't have much hair. It's a gift and a curse that I don't have much hair on my brows, but already I love how I'm able to gather all the hairs and just I don't know if you can tell the difference between this brow and this brow, but already this looks more defined. And we're just gonna brush up the brows. 
Wow, my brows look so slicked and defined, but it doesn't have that weird gel feel that sometimes brow gels have. And I really am liking this. This makes for a great no makeup makeup days where you can just brush up the brows and add some lip butter and pop out the door because yes, a lot. That was my favorite part, which is creating a colorful and bold look using Natasha Denona's Fest palette. And there are five shades within this palette. There are two matte, two velvety rich colors and one shimmer. What we're gonna do is go in with that brown and sweep it across our lids and you can already see how pigmented it is. Wow. You can already see the dimension that this one shade adds to the face. We're gonna diffuse it out with some of that orange at the top to give it a little bit more dimension. This looks really good, but we need some drama. So we're gonna add that gold pigment. It is so incredibly fabulous. We're gonna deepen that crease a little bit more. Add some shadow. Then we're gonna go with an angled brush and pop in that gorgeous blue color. Oh, that looks so good. And look how vibrant this looks. It is giving so much vibrancy and that's one of the reasons why I love Natasha Denona palettes. So much richness and just, ah! We're gonna line the eyes with some liquid coal using the Seraphine Cosmetic Liner. And I love how sharp the tip of this liner is because it allows you to create the most defined liner look ever. See what I mean? And there you have it. Very defined eyeliner look. What do you think? I'm gonna use this Toy Factory brush to blend out the eyeshadow a little bit more. I honestly am so obsessed with how this looks. I normally don't do a colorful under eye, and this right here is just, it's so fun. It's so fun and it's so colorful. It's now time to finish off the look with Sweet Streets candy paint shimmer lip gloss in the shade comet and we're just gonna add that on uh -huh. and already you can see a little bit of shimmer mm. in the wise words little mama this lip gloss is definitely popping i will say though that you do feel a little bit of the texture of the shimmer on the lips but it isn't jarring. It still allows the lip to glisten. Added a bit of liner to add some dimension. And this is what it looks like. There are two products within the box that we did not use, but are definitely worth mentioning. One of which is Keys So Care Golden Cleanser. Keys has such great products and I've had the pleasure to be able to use their skincare. Their cleansers are really good. I also recommend their exfoliating cleanser, which really gets all of the grime and dirt off of your face and leaves it cleansed and smooth and beautiful and this particular cleanser I have the larger version of it as well and it is really really good next is the verb exfoliating scalp nectar and I actually love Verb products I actually have their oil in my hair right now it's lightweight it really helps the hair to be nourished and moisturized and I honestly cannot wait to try the scalp nectar as well which I will definitely come back and report my thoughts to you within this month's shipments are refreshments products and I absolutely love their razors and their shaving cream and the reason that I love the shaving cream is not only because of its rich formula but it smells absolutely divine and this particular scent is citrus spritz which has the most nourishing formula ever my skin feels so moisturized after i use it and it allows for a really clean and smooth effortless shave i also like this five blade razor kit which comes with this reusable handle magnetic wall mount as well as these two five blade cartridges and i love taking this along with me on my travels because it's easy to pack these products are so amazing to use and i'm so glad that it came in this month's package 
Again, we created this fabulous look using the products within the July Glam Bag and BoxyCharm Box by Ipsy. And I am absolutely obsessed with it. What do you guys think? I hope you like it as much as I did. I typically don't do a colorful under eye moment and you can never go wrong with a little bit of blue under the eye. I think it makes my brown eyes pop and ah, I'm just so obsessed with this look. Again, please like, subscribe, comment down below. Let me know what your thoughts are and hit that notification bell. That way you are well informed for the next time that I upload. And until next time, 